to be honest, when I first started playing, I don't think I was that good. <laughs> um, but you know, I've got my parents to thank for, for keep bringing me down because um, the friends that I've made here are definitely friends that I've made for life, and, and that's part a massive part of rugby is um, it's a social aspect of it as well, being able to play with your mates. But um, early memories probably not so good, and then probably when the contact sort of thing, same things came involved. Uh, I started to like it a bit more. I don't know why I'm like that, but <laughs> that's um, that's definitely the case. So um, yeah, it's just there's, there's so many memories here, so it's, it's a special part for me. I, mean, I think even from the, the time that you know I first started playing here at Shumar Lions to you know winning the, the Scottish Schools Cup here, I think um, it's a massive part of, of my rugby journey, and I think Stuart Melville in general has a, has a massive part, and, and a lot of people at the club's um, career. You know, Stevie coached here. Jamie Hodgson and Jack Wayne both played here as well, so I think it's you know it's a massive part of the club game in Edinburgh. As well. Yeah, I can't wait. I think the next the next two years are going to be a massive part of my career. So to spend it at a place where I'm so comfortable and I'm so happy, and you know I can feel myself getting better every day is is a real privilege for me. Yeah, yeah so much so. I, I mean, as I said, it's for me. I like being in an environment where you're constantly being bettered and, and improving as a player, and I think. It's um, apparent to see that the, the back row that we have are, are constantly improving. I mean, you look at the form that Luke Crosby's in right now, and look at the form Hamish Watson's always been in. And it's it's just it's pretty apparent that we're we're all learning from each other and we're all picking up each other's best traits. Be it you know jackling or ball carrying, seeing someone else do it so close to you, it, it, you know it, it motivates you to, to get better. And I think that environment that we have, especially in the back row, is is, is one of you know, we all look out for each other and help each other get better. Try scoring is a weird one, I think, is you know, I think I went maybe 20 games without scoring a try and then I, mean, I had a couple in one and then I've, I've, I've been able to, to get a few more this season, but I don't know if that's necessarily my game or if that's just the strength of you know, the forward pack in general getting over the line, so it's um, it's nice to be in a position where other people can make you look good, so <laughs> that's a, probably another reason why I've re-signed. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I, I looked at the, the process a, a lot more than the outcome, I think. Um, you know, we're really big on, on making sure that you, you note down when and where you're going to get better so you're held accountable to it. So for me, it's just making sure I'm always, um, I'm always ticking off the boxes in the week on, on the, the skills that I want to get better at and, you know, the things that I want to get better at. And the coaches here are really good at holding you to account for that. So, if, for example, you wanted to work on your ball carrying, you could plan to work with them after the session, do a bit of drill with them and, and you're always getting better. And, I think that's the environment that we're breeding here is, is one where we're always looking to get better and improving, so that's probably a main reason of why we're looking to stay.